Hi guys, it's your girl Natalie, the one true diamond. Come, ooh. <laughs> I'm still the same. <laughs> Coming at you guys with a video. This is Vlogmas Day 3. Brother Man from the Fifth Floor. <laughs> Vlogmas day three, okay? Um, and I'm in my craft room, and it's a complete hot mess in here because I have been crafting, I've been making things, I've been making weaves, and to those of you who are on my Facebook page, and y'all seen some of the things I have been doing, this is the time of year where I get really, really busy. And so, yeah, um... I might, at the end of this video, attach some of the reads I've been doing so that y'all can see um, some of the ones I have made for people. But I decided, because I'm going to be doing some crafting things, um, to come on and show you guys how I do a memory ornament. I'm going to be doing several memory ornaments, okay? Um, yeah, let me... In case you guys didn't know, mm -hmm, my hubby blessed me, and I'm calling it early Christmas, y'all, because it was it was a nice gift just to get out of the blue, which he will do that for me at times. Um, he got me a Cricut Explorer Air 2. I knew nothing about using this thing. I still don't know how to use it that great, but I have been doing some things okay with it just little minimal stuff um let me see well after the card that they had us make let me show y'all the the project that they have you to do it kind of got bent up it makes you feel like oh that's easy i can do this uh -uh 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 -uh. I hope y'all do not hear the dog barking. Evidently, she hears me in this room and she's barking because her pen is right beside this room or either the deers are out and she's barking at them. So if you hear her barking, please, please, please forgive my brandy, okay? Anyway, this is the card that it had you make. Just fooling. Can you see that? Is it focusing? Okay, there we go. Try to trick you into thinking you're doing something. Just was so easy. So easy. Okay. Anywho. Trickery. Okay. Trickery. Okay. And also he got me the easy press tool. Where you can do like iron ones and things like that. Have not cracked that open because I have not done it yet. I'm just trying to learn these little basic things, okay? So the first real project <laughs> that I did was I put my name on my laptop. The one true diamond. Yep. One mistake that I did make was my ease. I, I guess I can't. I guess I'm illiterate. This one here. I was trying to pull it out. <laughs> and then I'm like, don't I know how to spell my name? <laughs> I was trying not to make it an E. And then I realized, oh my God, this is an E. You're tearing it up. But I think it's fine for now. So, yeah. So, I'm looking forward to it because all the crafting groups said, um, all the crafting groups said that they would, um, that it takes time. You know, you'll get used to it. So, yeah. So, I'm believing that. Okay. But, okay. Um, what I am trying to um, do tonight, get on subjects, so I'm not too long, is I'm going to make a memory ornament, okay? Um, and yeah, let me show y'all one that I made for someone else. Um, and these are the boxes. I purchased these boxes off of Amazon. If anybody's interested, if you, you know, could use it to make gifts or if you make your own ornaments because there's different things I want to be doing with my ornaments then um just let me know and I will definitely share my link where I got it from basically what I did was google small boxes <laughs> and it came up but I'll show you where I got it from if you need to know that okay so basically I just packaged it in with the tissue paper and 
a few strings of this red stuff here. Y'all know the little shreddy paper. But anyway, I'm kind of proud of it. Okay, y'all ready for this? You ready for this? So this is my memory on, you can hardly see it because it's on transparent paper. And I did, um, someone did say that Canon prints better than HP, but I have an HP printer. And I don't know if I'm going to invest in a actual Canon printer. But I'm trying to put my hand up so you can see it. It's hard to see up here, but it's her mom's picture. I wish y'all could see it. It's so pretty. It's her mom's picture. Anyway, and the saying says, because someone we love is in heaven, a piece of heaven is in our home. So, yeah. And it has a little snow at the bottom. And I put the heart. I made this with the cricket. And like I said, I know y'all can't see it. So y'all probably thinking, what in the world? There it goes. You can kind of see her face now. You know, it's and the writings on the side. And then this is the little bow that I made to go on it. And then this loop. I need a better loop because I don't like I don't like how that one looks. I really don't. But anyway, this is the ornament. So I'm going to put one together with, um, for my girlfriend's mom who just passed away. She came down and spent Thanksgiving with me. And Christmas, she's going with her son. So I want to put an ornament together for her. And basically, what you need is um, you can use your Cricut, if you have a Cricut, to come up with a program. Or you can do, if you know how to do something else, some people have the silhouette, I think is what it's called. Um, or you can just not have words in you with your picture and just bring you off a regular photo, cut it out to the size you want, and stick it down in your ornament. It's just simple um, to do. But transparent, um, I guess you could download it to your computer and use it now the transparency paper oops i got i got it off of amazon because i saw a lot of crafters use this one and they said it's the best kind so i just went behind them but and boy it's the apollo and it's a little pricey so you gotta be careful with this and be sure that you are ready to print and what i've learned i need to learn to do more than one project on the piece of transparency so you're not wasting so much of it because like I said I think this pack was maybe like close to $30 if it wasn't 30 I think for 50 sheets so expensive for me because I'm like I like the bargain okay so anyway what you're gonna need is this bulb it's plastic and this came from the Dollar Tree so this bulb was a dollar I've already printed her picture. You can't see it. But I already printed her picture. And um, I have the same words up there as the other one, which says, because someone we love is in heaven, a piece of heaven is in our home. And the reason why I'm not, like I could glue this on the back or another color on the back to make it, you know, stand out better. But in person, you really can see it. And you want it to be floating so you want it to be transparent so that's why it's this way and I know you can't see it you see it better that way but if you want you can glue this on to something and stick it down in your ball it's very easy and then you know I have ribbon I decided to use just a plain white ribbon um, on this yeah so I've already wasted up nine minutes talking y'all know I'm a talker talk 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 okay so basically easy peasy you're going to let me put it down so you can see y'all excuse this is my comfy gown so i'm sorry um just gonna pop the top off of it and you're gonna take your picture and roll it up just try to be gentle with it because you don't want to put creases in it and mess up the whole thing yeah, I just try to get it 
small as I can so I can get it inside and as you see it popped in the ball and you kind of have to play with it and I just have one of these wooden sticks I bought a pack of them from somewhere I don't know if it was in a craft store or what but yeah I just I bought it somewhere so this is what I've been doing with mine I like for mine to be facing on top of my ornament so you gotta play with it you got to play with it and I'm struggling there we go it's not doing well I will take it out I'll take my scissors and I'll just trim down just a tad bit and see I haven't got perfect with um I have not got perfect with these yet, like um, like make them where they fit exact. Like I know some people who've been doing it a while, been watching their videos, they have it down to a science of where it just fits perfectly in their ball. And so yeah, so. with it too much because I really don't want to bend my picture up. She is coming out a whole lot lighter than the other one is. I don't know if y'all you probably can't see it. But anyway, that. And I forgot to tell you my little snow. Oh, I got to get my snow. Or maybe I'm going to do some of these since her picture is so light. I'm using the little and I'm going to try to get them behind her if I can. I'm on the struggle bus. Okay. And let me cut this off of here. I think I'm going to have to put some paper behind her picture because I'm really, really, really not liking how hers is coming out. It's not coming out as um, good as the other one. You can see her a whole lot better than her. And I'm just holding it up. You can see her a whole lot better. So, um, Hold on, I'm gonna put some paper behind this. Okay guys, I have tried several things with this ornament to get it like I want it with um, putting different types of backing on it, but I couldn't get anything to stay. So I gotta figure out something better if I'm gonna do more of these ornaments, but this is the final ornament. And like I said, her picture is kind of light so you cannot see it on camera as well as you can up in person so I do apologize for that but yeah this is this is the final product <laughs> okay so anyway thanks for watching um, I will be back later with different videos this is vlogmas day three and i need to get to work on some other items and things so i'm going to do that and i will see you guys in my next video okay bye now